fuck? You. Mom. Ah, new kid, come, take a seat. You don't quite look like a boy, new kid, or a girl. You're like Prince. Dude, you gotta keep Mosquito away from those raisins, girls. If he relapses, that shit's on you. This isn't a mentorship program. Uh, why is the new kid in my space? I'm busy. Not there. Not there either. Mosquito likes that seat. All right, well, how's it going out there? Okay, good talk. Uh, well, listen, I think you show some potential, and uh, I'm gonna upgrade you to somebody's sidekick or something. Congratulations. I just maybe wanted to talk about your superhero character a little bit. Um, your character sucks, to be honest, and I think I'm gonna let you dual class. Let's pick another ability to add. So what kind of skill set are you looking to add to your repertoire? Cyborg. Elementalist. Ah, Elementalist. With power over, you know, the Earth and stuff. Cyborg. So yeah, what an amazing moment for you. You must be excited. Cyborg. More machine than man. Urgency is also an important trait for superheroes. Cyborg. Elementalist. Elementalist. So if it rains on me, it's your fault. Okay, I think those two will work nicely together. But now we're gonna need to change your backstory too. So let's go back again to that fateful night. Back when you were little. You did lay awake that night. But the reason you couldn't sleep was because you wanted to make the world a safer place. You walked to the mirror. You looked in the mirror and wondered if anyone would ever love you. And then you heard a noise, but, but it was a baby crying. Out in the hallway, you saw two guys attacking a helpless baby on the floor. You had to stop them from hurting that baby, didn't you? You knew you had the power to stop them, and so you called upon your newly discovered power. You had to stop these thugs and their traps. You started by entrapping the biggest in an ice prison. by the cold, the intruder could only watch as it turned past him bad. Hey, you can't just take a man's turn like that. Yeah, who do you think you are, kid? The intruders approached you, though little did they know they had set themselves up perfectly for a sand trap. I think this kid has some kind of power over ice and earth. Impossible. Took the opportunity to heal and focus your powers. I think I'll move over here. Oh man, I finally get a whack this damn kid. 
feeling focused, you shrugged off the blow and readied your ultimate attack. Summoning the powers of ice, water, lightning, and earth, you unleashed into the intruders an elemental onslaught. You beat them. You swept the baby up in your arms to take him somewhere safe, and then that's when the unthinkable happened. You saw your dad. Fuck your mom. And from then on, you had to live with the fact that because you were busy helping a baby, you couldn't stop your mom from being fucked by your dad. That's heavy, man. I'm really sorry. I know you probably want to know why. Why your dad fucked your mom, but those are answers you'll have to find for yourself. Cooning Prince alert! Cooning Prince alert! Seriously, guys, alert! Alert! The Cooning Prince alert! Mrs. Coon, what's happening? It's the Freedom Pal! What have they done now? Just get to Main Street! Hurry! We're coming! Coon! Ow! Well, new kid, looks like you might be needing those newfound powers. Follow me! Time to waste, Butho. missions are the worst. Ah, uh, god damn it. So close. Head towards Main Street, butthole, and gird your loins for battle. Yes, a little further. This bus was supposed to be here back in December. No, not that way, Main Street. The Freedom Pals are on Main Street, and right now we aren't. We're stuck here waiting for you. We were supposed to be a duo, remember, Twig? I remember. So when I walked out on Coon and Friends, you should have walked out with me. I like Coon and Friends. Because you had your own movie. Thank God you're here. They're really going at it. Super Craig had to have movies before Wonder Tweak was introduced. It made no sense otherwise. Your whole group makes no sense. Because you're a traitor, Tweak, and now you're with a group of super traitors. This was started by you. By people who thought there should be preferential treatment to certain heroes. We aren't the ones who walked out of the fucking franchise, Mysterion. Eric, you must listen to me. Right now, I'm speaking to you telepathically. Get out of my head, Timmy. Your franchise is going nowhere. 
Face the truth, Eric. You guys are kind of douchebags. He just called us douchebags in my mind. He did? All right, you son of a bitch. Ha! You're making a big mistake messing with Kunin, friends. I'm gonna kill out. Maybe keep your mouth closed next time. Trying to get killed or something? Fuck you, dude. It's Civil War, dick. You. All clear. It's Craig time. I mean, super Craig time. <laughs> Suck on this, camel pal. You are trying way too hard. Pepper tornado, point. Ah, you think you're still on the right side? Yes. <laughs> huh, who to infect? Meanwhile, at the Hall of Super Best Friends. Let all debts be forgiven and all slaves free. Somebody wake me when it's my turn. Ow. We 
Leaks hurt? What a surprise. The weather's about to turn! Bringing the thunder! Lame. No, you're lame! You're like the lamest lame of all time! That was lame, too. Super Craig to the rescue! Ever get the feeling life is punishing you for being a dick, Queen? No! Engage, Super Tornado! Look, you okay, Super Craig? Sure, I'm fucking fabulous. <laughs> Buzzing into action! their side, new kid. That's going to leave some scars. There's a storm coming! Hey, I thought I'm supposed to defeat Wonder Twink in my movie. Hey, Craig, think you could have a shittier costume? Does it look like I care? Well, that's kind of my point. <laughs> Taking a blood sample now. Dude, dial it back. my mind. You okay? No, seriously, you guys. He fucked the shit out of my brains. Uh, I grabbed him. We fought for a little bit, but his, his mental powers are too strong. So we did all that for nothing? Not quite. I got Timmy's cell phone. You did? There's sure to be a lead on that. Let's get this back to base. Super Craig can analyze it. You on the run, kid? Got the government on your tail? I'm such a softy for marginalized communities. Maybe because I'm like three of them. Pardon my French, but I think people are doo-doo heads. No judgments, kid. You're entering a safe space. I respect whatever life choice led you to dress like that, kid. Bet we're gonna have a rough winter. Is this the little superhero who is getting all the followers on Instagram? Your presence is requested at City Hall. The mayor of South Park wishes to speak with you. Don't make her wait.
Fuck. You. Mom. Ah, there you are, butthole. All right, let's get to work. What have you found, Super Craig? Kimmy's phone has a bunch of notes in it. Something about a girl who has information about all the criminal activity in town. What girl? It just says, find the girl with the dick tattoo. What girl in town has a dick tattoo? I don't know, Mosquito, but the Freedom Pals must think she's the key to finding the missing cat. If the Freedom Pals find her before we do, they'll get the $100 reward. We cannot let that happen. We have to stop the Freedom Pals from having a sweet franchise at all costs. Then we have to find the girl with that tattoo tonight. Fast Pass is right. We all have to sneak out of our houses tonight and search the entire town. What do you say, new kid? Are you up for it? Look, if you want to be a coon friend, you have to learn to communicate. Yeah, who let this guy join us anyway? Go easy on him, you guys. He's had a tough life. When he was six years old, his dad fucked his mom. What? I'm sorry, friend, but it's time they learned your tragic backstory. Butthole doesn't trust anyone because his dad fucked his mom and he couldn't do anything to stop it. That doesn't make any sense. I know. How could the person you trust do that to the only other person you love? Carbon, everyone's dad fucked everyone's mom. Huh? That's how it works, stupid. Our dads fucked our moms. Oh, right. So does that mean your dad fucked your mom, Cam? Huh? Yes! My dad fucked my mom! That's why I'm here! Don't steal his backstory, dude. That's not cool. You're so fucking stupid! Every human alive on Earth had a dad who fucked their mom and- Stop, stop. This is not what's important right now. We need to find the lady with the dick tattoo. Yeah, let's get home so we can prepare for evening missions. Let's go, coon friends. He's such a fucking idiot. It's okay. Calm down. I'm afraid you'll have to deal with that kind of bigotry your whole life, butto. When people don't understand, they lash out. I'm going to let you be a sidekick tonight to one of the coon friends. Go home and sneak out after your parents are asleep. I'll fill you in later. a mentorship program. Uh, why is the new kid in my space? I'm busy. Are you being even talking to the school counselor? Why'd you answer the phone? Have you lost your fucking mind? Our child felt the need to go talk to the school counselor. Doesn't that bother you at all? So you told him the truth? Yes, I said we were aware of our child's gender issues. You dumb bitch! You'll ruin everything! I don't have to listen to this from a stoned out pothead! I need a drink. Sure, drown your problems in Chardonnay, you stupid skank! Oh, hey, whippersnapper! Have a fun day out playing? <laughs> well, I'm exhausted. Gonna get ready for bed. Dinner's on the table if you want it, punk. But then straight to bed, okay? Pothead. Alcoholic.
sweetie, I just want you to know that whatever happens, Mommy always loved you. Good night, sweetheart. That time, that's when the creeps come out. But unfortunately for the creeps, the other thing that comes out at night is a key. Intruders? with the power of diabetes at his control. I used to be a simple elementary school student, but then one day, a freak science accident turned my diabetes into superhuman strength. All right, sidekick, we're supposed to go investigate a girl who might know the location of the missing cat. Follow me. Ready? Let's go, sidekick. Kyle's this way. I'm pretty much like Bruce Banner, a loner hoping to one day cure my diabetes, and yet knowing it means I'll no longer be able to fight crime. buy some more beer. I'm sorry, but Captain Diabetes cannot let you drive. I'm fine to drive, okay? Get out of here. Hey, give me my keys. You are in no condition, sir. I'm fine, okay? Look, wait, look, look. I'm fine, okay? Give me my keys, please. I'll return them tomorrow. Give me my fucking keys, you little shit! Think I can dance with this? Let's go! Take care, sidekick. Even debilitated, this is a dangerous foe. I'm not debilitated, I'm just jovial. <laughs> hey, I almost spilled my drink! Yeah, 
damn, I feel so tired all of a sudden. Give me my goddamn keys. I'm afraid that's impossible. <laughs> Give me my fucking keys! I can drive. Yeah. Oh, I'm so sleepy. Wait, why are we fighting again? I've made a citizen the rest of your team. Yeah. I'm fine to drive. I'm fine. Okay, okay. Okay, now I'm fine. You should be fine to drive at approximately 11 a.m. tomorrow. It's 11 a.m. somewhere. Want me to pick you up some candy from the storage? See, I can't believe I did that without falling. You can't stand up to my crusty sidekick.
This is humankind's secret base. Farts make me angry. The clone says it's because my mom farted when she gave birth to me, and that's why I have diabetes. I don't think that's why I have diabetes, though. I think it was a gift to help fight crime. I don't have my... This shortcut will take us right into the heart of downtown South Park. Come on, Jacket. Do not be afraid. People get diabetes because their mom started doing childbirth, do you? I, I feel like Kuhn made that up to make Captain Diabetes feel insecure about himself. As you can see, Sidekick, at nighttime, South Park is quite a different place. We've got to get into the Peppermint Hippo, to the town square. Here it is. Here's where we're going to find the girl. There are sure to be unsavory characters and lots of boobies inside. Come on, let's go inside. Hey, beat it, kids. 21 and over only. Stand aside, citizen. It is I, Captain Diabetes. I must speak with the ladies inside. Get out of here before I fucking throw you out. What the do? Hey, will you kids get out of here already? If you're gonna talk, take it the fuck outside. I told you to get out of here. Hey, there's fucking sweet hot tits back there and you're too young to see them, so fuck off! No one under 21 can see those hot fucking tits, all right? Get out. Look, everyone knows it's physically impossible to get past a red velvet rope, so just go away! Must be another way in somewhere. Look at this, guy. It's a way in. All right, detective work, sidekick. Now we just need a way up there. Over here, sidekick. I have an idea. Oh, of course. Stand aside, sidekick. <sighs> Watch, do you? Our girl must be this way. Ooh. Hey, what are you, a leprechaun? 
You're kind of creeping me out. Get lost, leprechaun.
DJ's spinning some real banging tunes. Please put your hands together for Destiny. Destiny. 